welcome all guests, uh, distinguished guests, uh, fellow teachers, and uh, last but not least, you students who are uh, listening to this lecture. That is going to be a brief, uh, um, <coughs> uh, uh, a, a brief uh, um, show of what wait, what's waiting for you, what lies ahead you and what's, uh, what are your opportunities in this program. So this is called the uh, secondary school program of uh, uh, the National Academy of Scientist Education. All right, so this is your introduction to our secondary school program. In this program, uh, you are called Senjuri students, Senjuri Arbet, after uh, the name of Senjuri Arbet, a famous Nobel laureate scientist. So uh, uh, you are Senjuri students, and your teachers are Senjuri teachers. And let us see a brief uh, uh, list of what activities are laying ahead of you. We would like to get involved, uh, we would like you to get involved in our laboratory work that you have uh, seen uh, even uh, yesterday. And uh, you will probably attend a lot of lectures where uh, mentors and uh, scientists, uh, worldwide scientists, uh, senior or, or junior scientists will have you lectures to see what's this all about. In these occasions, you can deepen your knowledge in the field, and you have practice that involves also manual skills to hold these pipettes to work with all these equipments that seem to be a little bit strange now, but you will get acquainted with them quite well. Uh, you get a lot of practice, and you can develop your personal skills, your uh, scientific skills, your uh, uh, manual skills in these uh, occasions. Uh, you also get more e effective competitors, so you have an advantage on regular uh, uh, curriculum uh, uh, competitions in biology, for example. And of course, you get closer to uh, actual research, and uh, you can talk to researchers, you can learn how researchers Ha uh, uh, have their, uh, their everyday life, you can, you can see what's waiting uh, ahead uh, if you decide to choose this life uh, style, exactly. So, hopefully in the end, our aim is to uh, shift to you to universities where you become senior university students. So let's see the staircase that leads to this uh, uh, um, <clears throat> goal. Uh, in our program, we have a three-level uh, uh, <clears throat> uh, program, education program, that is called th first, second, and third uh, level uh, senior ed students. Uh, we call it basic, uh, intermediate, and, uh, and advanced level education. So let's see some details of all that. In the beginning, you uh, entered a, a program as uh, senior ed first level students, so most of you, most of you here are Sanjari first level students who get this basic level education. So let's see what's involved in all this. Uh, Sanjari first level students have activities that uh, are taken, uh, that are um, uh, occurring either in their own school where they um, attend uh, activities in their own school uh, organized by their own teachers and also they uh, participate in the professional program by, uh, uh, offered by the academy in regional schools. Uh, in, on these occasions, you carry out uh, regular um, traditional laboratory activities, but also uh, modern molecular biology activities. Uh, you prepare protocols, that is, meaning writing all those uh, lab reports, uh, learn how to do that, uh, what are the, the rules for writing such papers. And also, you are advised, you are strongly advised to attend lectures, to get the most of these lectures that are given to you by uh, researchers and teachers. Uh, you are also welcome to attend competitions where you can uh, um, uh, get special skills, that is again something that you cannot get anywhere else, and also you visit these conferences which are where, where you are right now. Um, the venues of these uh, uh, 
uh, <clears throat> programs are called regional education centers. Right now we have 21 uh, regional, regional education centers, one in Marosvásárhely and the others scattered all around the country. And these are managed by 24 uh, senior senior teachers that I'm going to introduce you. Uh, so this is all the 24 senior teachers who are dedicated and experienced uh, uh, professionals in their field in biology and chemistry. Uh, they, most of them work in, in uh, secondary schools. Uh, so we have a long experience with students like you. And um, <clears throat> um, uh, we aim to, to find those talented students, to identify these talented students and help them get uh, um, getting on. Uh, so let's see what do we teachers do for you. We plan and organize the exercise and lectures in our regional school. Uh, sometimes it means a, a bit of traveling to you, but uh, this is something that dedicated students are uh, uh, supposed to, to take. So uh, you come to us, we plan and organize these uh, occasions for you and we give you information. Therefore, it's very important for you to have an email address that you regularly check, and you also check the spam, uh, because sometimes these messages can be lost. So please make sure that you uh, keep an eye on all of the messages we sent out to you. We send them as soon as possible, so you get all the information from us and from your teachers from events of like that. We also develop your course materials uh, whenever we have some new... <coughs> so, what, what did I do? Sorry. <laughs> uh, that's it, I guess. <clears throat> no, I'm back. Okay, so we develop new course materials. Uh, those papers uh, you can get at those uh, um, <coughs> uh, lectures and... and uh, 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 courses. Uh, we also take part in developing the long-term strategy, where to go, what to do, what new developments to carry on with you that uh, serve you best in the way of became, becoming a uh, scientist. Uh, we also have courses for other teachers, so we organize courses for ourselves because, uh, as you know, also teachers learn, that is called uh, lifelong learning, so uh, many of us uh, had to learn all these skills uh, some years before. So uh, just, uh, I just tell you to encourage you that also your teachers are continuously learning. So we uh, take these training courses. We also manage a database in which you can uh, um, um, involve, uh, get involved in our programs, uh, in which you can register, in which you can get information from our uh, programs. And of course, uh, we take you to conferences. Uh, those guys who uh, work best and are uh, dedicated can enter the second level that is called Sanjuri, second level or advanced, uh, intermediate pupils, and they have got other activities carried out uh, in uh, regional uh, centers. Uh, of course, you have to meet some criteria that involves continuity in work, so you uh, you are uh, supposed to regularly uh, take part in these programs. Uh, you participate in the activities of the regional uh, education centers. Uh, there should be at least eight such uh, occasions per year, but of course uh, you can have more of them. You, uh, these uh, students should pass a theory test, of course, where they, uh, they uh, must uh, solve uh, problem solve, uh, pro they must perform problem solving at an application level. So this is not just telling you what you have also le already learned. Uh, you, uh, these students are, uh, su um, are um, supposed to take part at least three of those modern biology practices that are, let's say, like ELISA or PCR or gel electrophoresis or uh, bacterium transformation. So besides those classical lab activities, uh, students also are advised uh, to take part in these modern labs as well. Uh, you 
must be in a possession of, of basic practical skills, so you need to be uh, familiar with using micropipettes, microscopes, uh, working with slides, dissection. So these are uh, the skills uh, senior uh, second level students must acquire. And also, uh, you are uh, um, supposed to uh, independent, pro independently process uh, uh, one course material that is uh, uh, signed, uh, assigned out by uh, re regional senior teachers. And of course, uh, those uh, students who uh, perform well on competitions are welcome in this program, so uh, plus points are awarded for competitors. Uh, the national re education centers are located at uh, five or uh, six uh, different towns. Uh, these are located in Gödöllő, Szombathely, Pécs, uh, Szeged, in, where we have two schools, Hódmezővásárhely and Debrecen. In these uh, ed national education, education centers, we have a different kind of programs for second level students. These last for several days, that is uh, typically weekend, so probably two or three days, because they involve, they, they need more time, because on these occasions we have a more in-depth analysis of a biological problem. So we did dedicate enough time to, to uh, deeply get into these uh, uh, questions. We have, a, we have longer activities that take several hours. These are more complex, they, they require basic skills, so of course these students would not start learning how to use a micropipette on these occasions, but we are, they are accepted, uh, they are supposed to have these uh, skills with them when they come to us. On these occasions, people develop uh, more complex problem-solving skills, so you, of course they learn a lot here, and it's a great occasion to meet other students who share the same interest, so uh, this is also a, a good place to make friends. Uh, we also organize programs for teachers in these education centers. So teachers come to us and uh, they take part in a training where they also learn these uh, activities, they, these processes, because much of them are also involved in their major exams. So sometimes, mo uh, more and more often, you will face such uh, questions or, or um, um, exercises on your final exam at secondary school. So please don't be surprised if you have a question concerning ELISA or PCR on your major exam. But of course, your teachers also need to know that, you know, know that first. We also maintain a close relationship with universities because as a final result of our uh, secondary school programs, uh, the next step is to get involved in university program because this program continues on university. So in those cities where we have a human life science program, uh, we have a, a cooperation with uh, universities in Debrecen, Debrecen Pécs, Szeged, uh, Budapest, and um, yeah, that's it, that's four. <coughs> Uh, those students who, are, uh, who get on the third level, uh, these are called advanced level education, they get in contact with university mentors. Uh, university program is uh, coordinated by Zoltan Rakonsai, this is, he's the head of university uh, relationships, and these students can start working regularly with a university mentor before they get into the university. So these are secondary school students, most often they're in their final uh, school year. But uh, by the time they enter, they actually enter the university, they are also a member of a research team where they can get a lot of experience and, other, and skills. So this is quite kind of saving time, not to be rediscovered in the university, but uh, getting into university where you can swiftly and fast uh, uh, contact a program and uh, achieve significant su success faster. Last but not least, we have cooperations with hospitals. 
uh, these hospitals are uh, <clears throat> enthusiastically supporting our program, providing opportunities for visiting skill labs uh, in uh, those uh, towns where we have these uh, facilities. Uh, this program is coordinated by uh, <clears throat> Christian Scheberg. And our program is uh, highlights uh, a great, uh, great importance on, on awarding secondary school pupil. So every pupils every year, uh, the program awards uh, pupil, pupil of the year or student of the year. Uh, this time, his lecture will be held right after this introduction, and we also provide a scientific summer camp that uh, this year takes place in Seged. Will be about ten, uh, five or six days long and you have an opportunity to visit uh, top research laboratories and get in contact with mentors who guide your activities. Last but not least, let us uh, briefly introduce our, uh, the leader of the coordinators of our work, Ad Adrian Lengye, who's, a, the, who's the director of uh, our program, Sándor Ban, who's our pedagogical expert uh, managing uh, teacher trainings, Zsolt Nistor and Robert Kertész, who are the heads of the national and the regional uh, education program, Rakoncai Zoltán, who is uh, uh, responsible for uh, university relationship, and Christian Sheböck, who coordinates uh, hospital visits with, in our program. So, please uh, find this as a... Uh, as a uh, <clears throat> Challenge again, uh, challenged in front of you. And please remember that although these stairs sometimes seem a bit, little bit difficult and sometimes your paths seem to have stones and uh, rocks around you, but uh, with a little, uh, oh, this is, <laughs> this is uh, what I, uh, the previous one. What I wanted to tell you that with a little bit of, of skill, you can make a staircase of those rocks that roll into a pathway. So I wanted to say something more optimistic, but this is also true. Okay, uh, please uh, stay with us, and thank you very much for your attention. Thank you. <laughs>